All right, guys, three minutes to go. This is just a little pre cool video to the video I'm gonna post about yesterday's adventures with my son, his tenacity, his commitment to keeping his word and how the universe blessed him. It's a few minutes long, but I promise you guys, if you watch it all the way to the end, you're gonna be happy you did. It's living proof that the movement we started on October 3rd is truly taking effect. Random acts of kindness will change the world. I promise you one random act of kindness at a time. Three minutes and go. So I'm here at my local Stater Brothers with Mini Mini and we're selling chocolates. Now, we did the right thing. We asked manager's permission uh, and we got here. And he's, he's doing his best to sell out. Somebody else is standing here who didn't ask permission. And I, you know, we're standing stuff on the other side, which isn't so much the hot spot compared to the other door. And uh, I told many, many, okay, we'll leave at 6.30, get him leave a little earlier than we had planned. And you know what he tells me? No, Dad, we're staying till seven. He made a commitment. That tells me I'm raising my son the right way. He's still selling, he's still doing his little thing. Uh, we have a few more boxes left. Thank you everybody who's already ordered them. I'll be bringing them on Friday or Saturday, depending on what day you're going. Uh, he's so close to his goal. And uh, look at my mini. Sometimes your kids are the ones teaching you the lesson. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. It's priceless, it's free. And I promise you, it will change the world one random act of kindness at a time. So, three minutes ago, we're wrapping up. My son already sold the box. The young girl, I believe she sold the box too, which is kind of cool. But he learned about adversity. He stood his ground as far as he made a commitment, he stayed. And some guy just donated $2 for him. And this guy goes, you know what, education is key. I'm an electrician. I got into it out of high school four or five years after he got into it, he was able to buy his parents a house. And his messages like that, that messages like that that really brighten my heart that random strangers are instilling positive messages in my kids lives and the fact that my son is a rock star status said you know what dad no we're gonna stay here we're on the quote-unquote cold side of the store per se and my son still sold like a beast and I'm really proud of him so in a world where you can be anything be kind it's priceless it's free and I promise you we will change the world one random act of kindness at a time I guess we're packing up now so three minutes and go, a random act to kind of change the world. So here's what happened. What did we just do right now, buddy? Um, so a guy who wanted his one chocolate bar gave me three dollars and then he said, give three ran random strangers three one chocolate bar. But what happened right before that? Tell me the universe doesn't conspire to help your dreams come true. My little man stuck it out on the cold side of the store because he made a commitment. The young lady sold her box and left. We came over here, literally sold the box almost in 10 minutes. He wants to stay an extra 30. We did a random act of kindness because someone donated a dollar because they weren't eating sugar. We gave it, literally, literally gave it to the young lady and the very next person came out directly to us said hey i want to buy a chocolate bar bought one and said i'm going to give you three more so you can bless three random people if that's not the universe telling me a random act of kindness to change the world i'm telling you a random act of kindness to change the world it's priceless it's free and we will change the world have a great day guys all right guys three minutes and go we're leaving so let me give you guys a little recap after that last video so we had probably about I want to say 20 to maybe $30 donated to my son for his cause, right? They're just like, oh, I don't eat chocolate here, you know, thank you, and telling him, oh, good job, and, you know, keep it up, work hard. So my son says, let's go inside and give the workers chocolates because they're all working so hard. So he had, you know, wafers and crisps, and so we start going into the store giving chocolates out to people, and he's telling them, look, people donated and I want to donate these chocolates to you guys for working so hard and allowing me to sell. A group of, a pair of young ladies came up and said, oh, I want to buy whatever you have left. Now, mind you, we have two boxes and a half left. And they're like, I go, do you want a whole box or do you just want what's left in the open box? She goes, you know how much is a whole box? I said, 60 bucks. She goes, you know what? Here you go. 
random act of kindness. He did it because it's the right thing to do and it's changing the world. It started a chain reaction of kindness for other people. That to me is a living proof that we're doing the right thing for the right reason. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. It's priceless, it's free, and I promise you it will change the world.